Hi, if you're new to the channel, thanks for coming over and welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. This video will give you a broad outline on the Edexcel A-Level Business Paper 2, Business Activities, Decisions and Strategy. The video will include a practice paper 2 calculation question and tips that the examiners want you to know about paper 2. There are three papers that you'll sit at the end of your A-Level Business course. Paper 1, Marketing People and Global Business. Paper 2, Business Activities, Decisions and Strategy. And Paper 3, Investigating Business in a Competitive Environment. This video will focus on Paper 2. Do check out the video that focuses on Paper 1 and it gives you information about the structure of the paper and also some tips. Paper 2 is a two-hour paper. 100 marks are available. You'll be assessed on theme two and also theme three. It's imperative that you answer all of the questions. There's a section A and a section B. You do need to be prepared for paper two to answer a range of calculation type questions. Now this could range from cash flow forecasts and break even type questions from theme two to critical path analysis and decision trees from theme three. So you've got to be prepared, you've got to know your formulas, you've got to know how to calculate them. The structure of this paper is similar to paper one. So you'll have section A and section B. In section A and section B, you'll have two four markers, one ten marker, one twelve marker and one twenty marker. I'd advise you to spend an hour on each section. It's 50 marks for section A, 50 marks for section B. There's also a case study for each section and it's important that your answers are in context. Now, there are four four markers that you would answer in this paper and the four markers or the command word for them tends to be explain or calculate. So it could be explain the impact of interest rates or explain the benefit of job production. And for the calculate type questions, you might be asked to calculate particular ratios or any other aspect of the theme two specification or the theme three. Here's a calculation type question that could come up in paper two. You can pause the video now and attempt it. I'll show the answer at the end of the video. Here are some tips for paper two. You need to ensure that you provide well-structured responses that clearly answer the question set. So do not deviate from the question. Take a moment or two to understand what the question is asking of you. You also need to ensure that you know how to answer these questions. You know how to answer a four marker, a 10 marker, a 12 and a 20 marker. So there's certain techniques and, and ways that you can answer these questions. Now, there will be videos coming out shortly on these. They will be in the exam techniques playlist. So do ensure you've liked, subscribed and click that notification bell so you know when they're coming out. Another tip is that you need to be able to apply knowledge effectively to the business context and the question asked. You must use the extracts and ensure that you're able to use key information in your answers as context. Look out for data, figures, charts, and where relevant, include this information in your longer answers. Revise the business formula thoroughly and practice calculations on a regular basis. It's also best practice to include the formula in your answers to calculations. Do check out the calculations playlist, which includes some key calculation videos with exam style questions and answers, which might be helpful to know prior to your exams. And finally, remember the 10, 12 and 20 mark questions need to be balanced. So you need to look at arguments for and against. If you do not include this, you will lose out on those evaluation marks. So even if the question is worded as assess the benefits, you must look at both sides of the argument. Now here's the answer to the sales revenue question. Did you get it right? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching this video and good luck with your studies. Oh,